All right, so this dumb woman pulls this Hyundai Sonata in there. Look at the way she parked. She's a foot from the Honda. She's five feet from the Subaru. Wheels are wampus. She's in a puddle. A terrible park job. So Taylor puts one of those things on the car that says, uh, what's it say? You suck at parking. One of those things Colt made. So uh, we're going to film her coming out and see if she sees it. But needless to say, we're over here, uh, Panera, it's just after two o'clock. Taylor's just getting his lunch now. It's a beautiful day. It's only about 63 degrees, but if the sun stays out and it's kind of half and half intermittent, um, then it's really nice. So it's nice to be sitting out. I had myself a brownie and some chips and he's having a, a soup bread bowl thing. How was it? Delicious. Friggin' right. Uh, I guess it's not her. Uh, there's our victim. I'm gonna set the camera down. Can they see? Kind of. Oh, almost blew over. I don't think she's gonna notice for the record. I don't think so either. I don't know what she's doing. The door's stuck open. All right, we'll check back in a minute. Wow, this woman can't even back out. She backs over right six feet and then straightens it out. Oh, I see it on the window. It's gonna fly off. There she goes. Learn how to drive. Uh, we got an Audi S5 over there that uh, a woman was driving. The front wheels are black and the back ones are silver. It is not that hard to maintain a car. It just takes some time. People don't do it right. And that pisses me off. Learn how to park. Seriously? Come on. For the benefit of all of us, just pull in the park straight, straight at least. Ah, uh, we got a classic 60s Corvette over here. Beautiful day for a beautiful car like that. Absolutely gorgeous. I think, think that one's a manual too. I've seen it. Is it an AMG? Is it? Nah. Still a pretty car. Oh my god, guys, it's 8.07 p.m. and it turned into a beautiful evening. Uh, it's just about 62 degrees now. And I went home right after we were at Panera. I got home about 2 o'clock and I just finished mowing. I have never spent six hours in one day doing lawn work before. I did one and I thought, oh, that looks nice. I should really do another one since I'm not going to be around tomorrow. I did that. Then my neighbor comes over. He's like, when are you going to get to mine? Uh, tomorrow would be fine. And I thought, well, that would be fine with me too, except I'm not going to be here. So I did that. The total mileage, I had to do one of them. I had to go over it twice because uh, the grass was really high and the first cut didn't get everything over. So. I went over one of them twice, I did the other two, did good jobs on all of them. Total mileage that I walked this afternoon according to the iPhone pedometer app, 13.19 miles. Feels good, but that's a lot of work and I can't do that very often. That's a lot of mileage, guys. Going over to Cannons now, we're going to go get some grape juice. Alright guys, it is 12 o'clock. I am absolutely exhausted from uh, all the yard work this afternoon. Ken and I just ended up going downtown. There's like nine, nine or there were seven 9-11s downtown. I didn't film anything. Uh, I've been doing emails and crap since. So uh, I'm just going to put this together real quick. And that's going to be it for today, day I think 515. Very productive, a lot of work. That's a long way to walk in a day behind a mower. So that's it for me. I'll talk to you tomorrow.